Right, so today we're thinking about Paul and his travels all around the world telling people about Jesus. So we're going to make a signpost about Paul's travels. So, first thing you need to do is if you can, you want to print out the sheet with 10 arrows and the bit that says Paul's travels. If you can't print it out, that's fine. You can draw 10 of your own arrows and write Paul's travels yourself and then cut them out. Or you can draw them onto the signpost, whichever you prefer to do. You will need some felt pens, some print stick, scissors and another piece of paper. Now, because I know this is going to take a long time, I've already cut mine out. There you go. So I've already got my Paul's travels. And the next thing to do is colour them in. So I'm going to do that and you can go off while I do it and then come back when it's done. Right, so cut all your arrows and bits out and I've, t I've actually taken a step ahead which is written all the names on for all the places but I don't want you to do that at this stage because otherwise you might get some of them the wrong way around. Now what you're going to do is you are going to draw yourself a post, something a bit like that. I've put a bit of grass in at the bottom so that it's not floating and you're going to stick your Paul's Travels bit at the top. Then you're going to start and stick the different places that Paul went to on his journeys. I'm going to stick these on and you'll come back when I've finished. Right, there we go. I've Stuck them all on now. As I say, stick all yours on first because otherwise you might end up with some of your words upside down. I know that because I did it. I got it wrong. So don't try and be clever and get ahead of yourself like I thought I was going to do because I had to redo some of them. These are some of the places that Paul went to in all of his travels. And the thing that they all have in common is that every, at every place he took every opportunity to tell people about Jesus, even though that meant that he ended up in prison, he got stoned, he was shipwrecked, he still couldn't stop himself. He had to, at every opportunity, tell people about Jesus and he went, sometimes went back to places, even when they'd thrown him back out to finish what he'd started. Sometimes when we learn lessons like this, we think, what's that got to do with me? So I want you to make your signpost of Paul's travels, stick it up somewhere at home and every time you look at it, think about where God's putting you, where he's sending you, where he wants you to go and spread the word about Jesus and Jesus' love.